How to get rid of under eye bags. Are you waking up with under eye bags? But here's a solution inspired by Michelle Fawn's YouTube tutorial. Today I'll be making these green tea eye pads for those under eye bags. Clinical evidence suggests that green tea is packed with health and beauty benefits that you can enjoy whether drinking it or applying directly to your skin. Even the leaves can be used as gentle exfoliants guaranteed to give your skin a healthy glow. Here are some cotton pads, green tea, and hot water. So I highly suggest that you buy um, the cotton pads that stretch out, that don't have the seams at the edge. That way you can use it as um, a face mask as well and you can stretch it to fit your face. First take two tea bags and place it into hot water and leave it in there for about three minutes. Next, you just dip the cotton pad into the hot water and I just placed it on the edge of the cup so that the excess water can just drip back in. I used about four pieces here, but you can make as many as you want. What I like to do is I like to make a lot and freeze it and store it so that I can have it at hand whenever I do need it. Also, what I like to do is after I dip it into the hot water, you can place it onto your face before doing a facial mask to open up your pores for thorough cleaning. So after you dip the cotton pads into the hot water, you can place it into a container like this. What Michelle Fawn does, she puts it in a Ziploc bag, but I didn't have any around. So I just place it into the container and you put it in the freezer for about 15 minutes. So in the morning, you can take out these frozen cotton pads to help cool down your under eye bag. Don't throw away your leftover green tea leaves. You can use it as an exfoliant and also a facial mask. So just take the leftover green tea leaves and place it on your skin and start exfoliating the skin for a healthy glow. You can also add yogurt and honey onto the green tea leaves to make a facial mask to hydrate your skin. Hope you enjoyed this quick tutorial. Please do visit my blog.